So I got a new MacBook. My old one is just so slow now and editing on it is literally a pain in the ass. So I got myself a new one and I'm so excited to open it because I actually have to edit today. Also, if I look very sleep deprived, it's because I am. <laughs> I actually woke up from a nap like an hour ago, but yesterday night I slept at 6 a.m. Yesterday I was up all night trying to finish filming like a haul. It's just because I literally have the worst procrastination skills skills like wait does that even make sense i need to fix my habits before i go into university next year because i'm seriously just gonna like fail i've actually been sleeping past 5 a.m for like a month now that's seriously so bad for your health please don't do that but yeah anyways i'm going to be unboxing this macbook i got the 13 inch macbook pro with the m1 chip i'm not like too much of a tech person but i know that the m1 chip is like a new thing for the macbook or something that makes it faster and like have more gigabytes which i need because like every time i edited on my old macbook it would just crash this one has one terabyte which is a lot of gigabytes i think my old one had like 121 gigabytes Hey Siri, what's the weather? Hey Siri, what's the weather? So I finally set up my Mac. I currently have my other Mac just right here and I literally have a mirror on it. A lot of people ask which MacBook this one was, like my old one, and it's the MacBook Pro. I got this one in like 2018, so maybe that's why it got really slow. This one doesn't have the touchpad thing, and this one has it. I still don't really know how to use it, but it's so cool. Hopefully, there's not going to be any issues when I edit now because the main reason why I always pull all-nighters is because I edit. On my old Mac, it was literally the worst thing to do. I finally changed my wallpaper. My wallpaper is Death Note. My icon is Megumi. So I just took my vitamins and I wanted to thank Kara for collaborating with me for this video. Kara helps you find the right vitamins personalized just for you. These products are formulated with clean ingredients that are backed by science and I love how they're very transparent with the research behind each product. Also, Kara's online quiz makes it super easy and convenient to know exactly what vitamins and supplements you need. For me personally, I wanted to focus on immune and hair health because I have a really messed up sleep schedule and my life style is not at its best at all. I don't really move my body. I don't exercise. So Kara recommended me vitamin D for immune health and keratin for hair health. There's also three more vitamins I take along with that to help me with stress and my mood, my indigestion because I get very bloated. Their vitamin packs are also compostable. They come in these cute little packets that are designed just for you. It'll have your name on it. Mine says, hi Tracy. Since spring is finally here and with the warmer weather, I really want to have a healthy reset. I think switching from bulky bottles to to Carol's compostable vitamin packs is one simple way to practice a more eco-friendly mindset at home. So take care of quiz and see what vitamins and supplements they recommend for you. Click on the link below and use my code Serango for 50% off your first month at care of. I'm honestly not feeling my hair or outfit today. I'm going out to take Instagram pictures again. Okay, so we are now in downtown. She says fashion queen. Um, so if these pictures don't turn out good, I'm actually going to cry because this is like my fourth time trying to get these pictures. You look like all you need. The hair color and the outfit. We are getting Starbucks now. I changed my outfit again because I was taking Instagram pictures. I'm vibing. I mean, vibing. I'm vibing.
as you saw by those clips my room is very messy right now lately i've kind of been in a little slump my life is just always the same routine and it's really bad for my mental health and i feel like you can also see that in my videos so lately i've just been like i don't really know what to film i feel like all of my vlogs or my videos are literally just the same so sometimes i'm just like are my videos boring or repetitive i feel like social media is consuming my life I've also been wanting to redecorate this wall. I'm not too sure though because like I kind of like it but at the same time it looks cluttered and messy. I just want like a simple more like minimalistic aesthetic vibe on my wall. Oh my god, I love the new ending. I'm currently working on an assignment and this is like worth 30% of our marks so it is a pretty big assignment and it's due on Thursday. Today is Tuesday so I have two more days to do it. I kind of like left it till last minute. I think I'm just gonna take a quick nap. It's currently 6.07 p.m. so I'm just gonna take a quick power nap like 30 minutes. That was honestly a much needed nap, but my head is starting to kind of pound. Usually if I take a nap, I will not be able to wake up for like hours. So I'm kind of surprised that I woke up today. <laughs> I'm going to be doing a little haul because I just got a package. I'm pretty sure this is my long overdue birthday gift from my mom. I literally mentioned this like in my birthday vlog like two months ago, I think. And it took this long for it to arrive. I feel like I'm always opening Aritzia packages in my videos. I got a zip up in this pretty baby blue color in case any of you guys are wondering this is the cozy af fleece zip up i'm seriously so lazy that i'm just gonna try it on top of my hoodie the color is so pretty okay so i took the hoodie off and i'm just wearing the zip up now and it's so nice i love it this hoodie is also from aritzia like Sponsor me, Aritzia. So next up in the haul, we have a few things from YesStyle. I just have like a little addiction to online shopping and buying useless things that I probably don't need. Here we have this pearl necklace. I haven't worn this yet, but it's very pretty and dainty. Honestly, will I wear this? I don't really know because I have a lot of necklaces now. You can't tell right now because I'm wearing a lot of layers, but this is what the necklace looks like. I actually really like it. Also, my my lips are so chapped oh my god i got another necklace and this one i actually wore in like my haul and in the clips before it's a chain necklace with a heart pendant it's actually a locket like that i honestly don't know what i would put in here but it kind of hangs low and i don't really like that because i don't know why but i like when my necklaces are like short like this length so but it's not really a problem because i can just kind of like leave it like that by myself and it stays okay so for the last thing that i got some of you guys are gonna be like what <laughs> everybody knows like the cat boy trend the cat ears so i just had to get myself some cat ears <laughs> these were honestly such an impulse buy like they were kind of stupid to get but since my friend got them with me we both were like you know what let's just who cares let's just get cat ears i don't even know how to explain how badly i wanted these 
for the longest time. I always used like that cat ear filter on Instagram. Look how cute they are.